Well, hello there and welcome to another training nugget. In this video, I'll be showing you how to add text in your Loom video. So let's get started. When you're working with Loom, it is very possible for you to add text that describes your video and even add some sections that enables the viewer to get more insight about your video. And to do that, the first thing I'll do is to navigate into my Loom account, loom.com. I have already shown you how to record a video. If you don't know how to, then check out my other videos on how to record a video using Loom. So I have logged in into my workspace and from my library section, I already have two videos. I will pick one video that I like to add text to and once it opens in the player window, you can tell that I have quite a number of edit options that I may use. By navigating at the top section on the edit command, I can use this option to trim. I can also add a link and of course edit by transcript. Notice that I also have the remove filler words and the remove silence in my video. So to add descriptive text, if I scroll down below the video, I have the summary option. This gives me an overview of the contents within my video. If I click in there, I have the ability to do backspace and erase some of these contents. And I can also type depending on what I would want to have. The editor here allows you to just enter simple text and does not have necessarily so much sassy fonts and colors to use. If I would want to add a chapter, then I navigate to the bottom section of my summary and select the Add Chapter option. If I need this to be a 0 0.1, uh, chapter 1, and I can copy that and say, well, copy and say there's another chapter 2 and chapter 3 and chapter 4. But for me to use these chapters, Loom requires me to break down this video into different segments. And in this case, my video doesn't have any segments and that is why my chapters are appearing as none. Remember, you can also add tags into your video to make it more searchable and relevant depending on the content that you're using. If you'd like to delete any text within my video, I will navigate to the top section of the holder and select the delete command that is available at the top right location. Notice that when I am interacting and collaborating with other users, then I am also given an option to comment on my video. So I select the comment option and I can tap in there the comment of my choice. Notice that it also tags in the timestamp that I have already commented. Well, there are other options within here, the title and summary added, that I can also do a little bit of manipulation, make sure that my video is understandable by the person viewing. Well, among many other pieces that you can do, Loom becomes a very user-friendly application when you want to communicate using videos. Screen recording options become easy when you're using Loom. Well, I hope this video has been very informative. If you liked it, hit the subscribe button and I will see you in the next nuggets.